Hi, it's Dave Safford from IES Technical Sales. We're here today talking a little bit about how to heat um, lines, either stainless steel or polypropylene lines, Teflon lines, uh, primarily for condensation reduction. So if you're bringing uh, gas from one location to another and you want to uh, keep it in solution and not have it condense out along the way, oftentimes things need to be heated uh, potentially as high as 200 degrees C. So um, this little video shows a little uh, about a way uh, to allow us to do that. In this case, what we're doing is we are um, we have these stretched to length heaters. They're basically vulcanized um, little silicon rubber heaters with wire wound elements inside, and they are vulcanized to a specific diameter. In this case, it's um, a quarter inch diameter, and it basically wraps around like the uh, telephone cord coil or a pigtail. They sometimes call it. And, um, and in this case, we have a piece of insulation that is um, cut and uh, wrapped around this thing. Again, it's, it's, it's designed to be very flexible and allow you to move it as you, as you require for your application. Um, the insulation is uh, just slit, and it allows you to uh, put it on very easily after the heater is installed, and then uh, close it with a Velcro strap or um, tie wrap or something along those lines. So. As far as control goes, there are a couple of different ways to do that, and, uh, and I wanted to talk a little bit about uh, obviously closed loop control. This is a very small gauge uh, capped on K type thermocouple, and normally what we would do is we would peel this off, peel and stick it right onto the tube itself, and then wrap the heater around that, and then wrap capped on tape around that to make sure that we're having intimate contact with the sensor and the tube and the heater all at the same time. And we would run that back into a, a temperature control, like this one right here. And um, this is designed, it'll actually run um, up to 15 amps um, in an on-off uh, uh, control scenario uh, and allow you to control within you know, plus or minus a degree or so um, along this line. So uh, as you can see, this uh, allows for a very flexible um, bend radius on this and very uniform heating around the, the, the whole line and you can daisy chain up to uh, 15 amps worth of these uh, heaters on a single line through a uh, temperature control zone. So please uh, explore these and other interesting um, solutions at um, IES Technical Sales and um, I look forward to talking to you soon. If you need to call me directly, my cell phone number, again, is Dave Safford, 603-770-0534. Thanks for watching.